So it's down to business here. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Of course, Manuel Neuer. He doesn't just do Lewandowski! Again, let me mention what a wonderful stop the goalkeeper pulled off there. Really wonderful. Tries to switch the play. It's Lewandowski! Oh, he did the hard part right, but not the finish. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited, and they need filling, and fast. Coman, Gnabry! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Coman can take all the credit for reading the situation, but careless defence played its part. for a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. A 1-0 lead established. Well, that's the currency he deals in, and he's come good yet again. Never the one to let you down in these situations. Tries his luck. It's bounced out. Coleman with a predatory goal. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Shoots! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Kimmich with the short one. Muller. Muller with a shot! In he goes again! Oh, that was extravagant by any standard. Lewandowski certainly showed brilliant imagination there to take on such a high tower of skill. Goretzka. Lewandowski. Finds himself eased off the ball. That's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. And he's there to cut it out. Oh, some clever movement up front. Yeah, they're playing with a, a false nine, and no one's really holding a fixed position up there. How does that work? Well, I think it's an attempt to just confuse this defence with, with constant interchange and, and different movement. Chance! It just took too long getting forward. Uh, Peter, the best counter attacks are, are pacey and incisive, we know that, and that will never really got going. And the first half is done. We can review the first half. Bayern Munich just didn't want the half time whistle to be blown. Convincing and controlled. Bayern Munich go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. And the game has already resumed here. It's still a possession, this, but very little to show for it. Hernandez. Schuller. Lewandowski he is effectively being marked out of the game here. Yeah, he's an elusive customer. He can get between the lines and behind them, so he must be more closely marshaled like that. Plays it out to the wing. And he's on a charge. Oh, that is lovely footwork. This is gone, that's a foul.
sensational save. Coleman, a scorer already in the game. Schuller passes it forward. Coleman pinged one through here. Great leap! He's got options out wide. That's too far for anyone. Hernandez goes back to base. Drives it towards the front. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And it's Gnabry. Gnabry drives it forward. It's Lewandowski! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Bayern Munich take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. Easing away. And that is that. Bayern Munich, a class apart. Opponents torn apart. They are comprehensive winners. What are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they said.